Well, hello everyone. It's Richard Kadish, owner and broker in charge of Go Gated Realty, Hilton Head Island in Bluffton, South Carolina. Today is April 9th, 2015. We're on Hilton Head Island at the Paddocks, a brand new K Havnanian community of homes. And to see this one, number 16 Hackney Pony Lane. It's a large house with 3,750 square feet four bedrooms, four and a half bathrooms, three car garage underneath. It's beautiful inside. We're gonna walk through and take a look at it. Uh, it has a very interesting floor plan and it's brand new. It's listed with Keller Williams Realty and I'm showing it to you as a buyer's agent with 39 years of Hilton Head Island real estate experience. I know it's breezy out here you may not be able to hear everything I'm saying. Let's just look around the neighborhood, get an idea of what this uh, community is. And again, my name, Richard Kadish, K-A-D-E-S-C-H. My company, Go Gated Realty, like gated communities. I'm the gated community specialist, ladies and gentlemen. And both Go Gated Realty and Gated Community Specialist are federally registered trademarks. And the Paddocks is a gated community. It's right next to the equestrian center called Sandy Creek Equestrian. There's the community swimming pool and clubhouse. We have a dock with a pond here. It's a quiet part of the island. But let's walk through and take a look. The garages are actually around on the back side. There's a parking alley around back or uh, a driving access around back. And you can see the entire house is elevated on piers. If I didn't say so already, this house is for sale at 579,438. And it is absolutely brand spanking new. It's uh, just getting its punch list, actually. Now our exterior is hardy plank, which if you're not familiar with hardy plank, it's a concrete fiber board. It's the latest and the greatest. Bugs don't eat it, doesn't rot. It's beautiful. This is kind of a country style home in many ways, but very modern in many ways. Country style in that we have the front porch, and you can look out across the neighborhood. And modern in ways that you're going to see when we go inside because of course it has the latest building materials, granite countertops, beautiful design, open design, the modern design or should I say contemporary design. This is our foyer entrance, our dining room immediately to the left, living room straight ahead, stairway to the second floor is here, and in addition to the four bedrooms and four bathrooms, we have this beautiful office immediately to the right with the double doors that give us the same view that we just saw from the front porch. Not a bad place to work or study here at home. Looking over towards that Sandy Creek equestrian facility and out onto the dock. Very close proximity to the swimming pool. Now this house is being, this house is staged. So the furniture that you see in it, it means it's been professionally decorated. Just to give you an idea of the scale of things, the furniture is not included in the sale. Immediately to the right here, we have a half bathroom with the uh, pedestal sink there and the wall mirror. We have flat ceilings throughout this house and wood floors, as I said, looking very good. Let's cross over here and look at this dining room. We have coffered ceilings, ladies and gentlemen, with lots of crown molding in each coffered section. We have wainscoting around the base of the room with a rich chair rail cap. Big over under windows. And here's a look back towards our 
foyer entrance. And as we come into the living room area, we have this big open kitchen living room area. Contemporary floor plan with the coffered ceiling out here in the living room. Looking very good. For those of you who want a fireplace, we have that too. It is a propane log fireplace. And we have the, looking into the kitchen, we have the one level breakfast bar, which is the new way that the homes are being built. Granite tops, the wood floor continues right on through. And this uh, sink has the single stainless steel bin that's so popular these days. You know, oftentimes people have to decide, do they want two sides? Do they want one side bigger than the other? Well, it turns out that what has emerged is that most people just like one big bin, stainless steel, swan neck faucet with the rinsing tool, stainless steel dishwasher, which I'm sure is quiet because these open kitchens require a quiet uh, dishwasher. And over here, we have a ceramic top range with the range hood. We have beautiful subway tile behind the range as a backsplash all around behind this granite countertop. And we actually have two styles of granite here. We have the one on the countertop and the designer has mixed it up with this second style here on this countertop. Big open room, informal. This house would be really great as a family gathering place, as a second home. It also would be fine as a primary home, of course. It's so big, it's a big family home, and it makes me think that it would be an outstanding vacation second home for the right family. Our ovens, our refrigerator is missing there. Look back into the dining room here at the front. Lots of light in this house, very light and bright. And in this particular house, the master bedroom is on the first floor. Let's go take a look. Come around the corner here. A little privacy jog on the way in. We see the master bathroom. Well, let's continue on to the master bedroom before we see the master bathroom. Here it is, it's a very large room. Recessed ceiling. It is wired for a ceiling fan, which of course I recommend for comfort and economy. High windows for light, but also privacy. Plenty of room for all your king size furniture here. This is a very large master bedroom. Lots of light out there. Now there will be houses built across the driveway there, and that won't be open forever, but when we get to the upper floors, your views will continue, you'll see. And your back porch here is quite large. It's got the synthetic wood deck. It's a, a Trex or similar type of a product on the deck. Two sliding glass doors, your hardy plank siding, and your wood ceiling all out there on your back deck. Very large master bedroom here on the first floor. We have high baseboards. We have high baseboards too. And that's kind of a country style that people like. The wood finishings in this house are very attractive. Now you'll see some little blue tape here and there. That's your punch list items. That's the builder telling the painter that he has to come back and touch up. Good quality control with K. Havnanian. Now here's our master bathroom. Right at the entrance to the bedroom we have dual, uh, dual basins here, his and hers on the vanity top with the granite top, the undermount, porcelain sinks, the brush metal hardware that everyone likes. Two fixed wall mirrors and wall lights looking very good. And this beautiful porcelain on the floor which looks like Carrera marble but it really is porcelain. Very clean, rich, beautiful look. Most people really like the Carrera style. Big soaking tub here, a bit of a centerpiece in the bathroom. The big splash around, high window. Our uh, water closet is over here. Your Hilton Head homes have the commode tucked into a closet. 
usually and this one has a high window again privacy but also light and we have a big walk-in shower here with the brush metal frame the glass panels that Carrera marble goes right on in and up the sides now I'm saying Carrera marble it's really Carrera like marble it's porcelain and a big walk-in closet big closet now what this uh, what K Havnanian has done here with this paddocks property is they have used a local builder, a local architect, excuse me, to, this is a huge master bedroom closet, wood panel doors here with the brushed metal knobs. What K. Havnanian has done is they've used a, a local architect to design this property, this, this project, if you want to call it that, this group of homes, specifically at the paddocks. And so we have some very interesting designs here and uh, beautiful, luxurious use of space, laundry room, that's where your washer and dryer would go, your wash bin down at the end. So we have K. Havnanian's uh, name on the property. We have a local architect designing this house and the others that are available. And we have totally here at Padex, there's uh, 30 home sites that K. Havnanian owns. And you know, they've already built out about 15 homes. So there's only about 15 home sites left. They started just uh, about a year ago. So it's been a big success. If you're looking for a new home on Hilton Head Island, the idea of buying a new home in the $500,000 price range, especially with 3,750 square feet, well, I think your search might stop here. Most people would be renovating at this price and at this size. This is, uh, when we come up the stairway, here's a second floor living room, not included in the four bedrooms that we spoke about. This house has all kinds of space, and in addition to which, there's this sitting area over here at the front of the house, not included in the four bedrooms, not even mentioned in the listing as being a loft. This has all kinds of space in this house. Big closet here. This is why I was saying that this house would be a very uh, suitable, large family meeting uh, vacation home. Now here we have our second bedroom, depending on how you're counting. On the second floor, walk-in closet there to the left. And we have a, a, a private bathroom here with again a granite top. Beautiful tile floor with the soft brown sandy pattern. And tile surround so the quality continues through the bathrooms which is a mark to me of a luxury home. So our second bedroom Good light here, good windows. And then at the back of the house, we have, well, we'll pass another bathroom here that is really outstanding. Beautiful tile, just like what we saw. Big granite top on that vanity. Fixed wall mirror. Same tile that we saw in the last bathroom. This one's even bigger. And this would be our second or third bedroom, depending on how you're counting. It's a big one, catches the afternoon sun. Right now it's about 4.20 in the afternoon. No, 5.20 rather, in the afternoon on April 9th. This room also has a big walk-in closet right here. Beautiful room. So we've seen the master on the first floor with an office. We've seen the second and third bedrooms. We have this second floor living room. We've seen two bathrooms. We're going to pass through this sitting area and head up to the top floor where we're going to find another bedroom that could even be two. Come up to the top floor, head to the back, on our way, we have an entrance to a bathroom and another bedroom. Three windows at the back, 
four windows rather. This room has some outstanding views, deep water views even in the distance of Calabogie Sound that probably will still remain when the other houses are built because they will peek across the rooftops there at the distant water of the intercoastal waterway. What a beautiful bedroom this is. And this also has a walk-in closet here. And a bathroom similar to the one we saw downstairs with the beautiful handles and pulls. The granite top, undermount sink. The quality continues. We have the tile surround for the shower and tub. This is our fourth bedroom. And yet here at the front, we have another sitting room which could be anything. Just extra bonus space. What a house, what a house. 3,750 square feet. And again, the price is 579 438. Well, let's go downstairs. We're going to go under the house and then we'll take a walk over and see the swimming pool for the community. The annual HOA here at the paddocks being $1,391.50. And of course, that's for all the maintenance of the exterior grounds, the common areas. So down we go, it's going to be dark here for just a moment. And we're going to come down, 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 down and look at this big space underneath the house. So they're calling this a three car garage, could even be more, but you have this one on this side with the small car, single car garage door and on this side you have the two car doors, all with automatic door openers and vented for good ventilation. Let's go outside, take a quick look at the outside here. We have a covered garage door entrance with the carriage style garage doors. Back of the house gets the afternoon sun. Number 16 Hackney Pony Lane, Linton, ladies and gentlemen. A little breezy out here, so you may not be able to hear my words. Our propane tank is there to fuel the fireplace. And this is a little storage area, and your heat pumps are located there on that second deck. Well, let's walk over and see the swimming pool. I'll give you my contact information as we go. I invite you to give me a call, drop me an email, let's get acquainted and find the best property for you, either here at the paddocks or elsewhere on Hilton Head Island or possibly Bluffton, the town just across the bridge from Hilton Head Island. You've probably driven through it many times, but it is actually a wonderful place to live. Well, my name again, Richard Kadish, K-A-D-E-S, CH, my company Go Gated Realty, and my cell phone 843 684 2933. And my email address rich at gogated.com. That's R I C H at G O G A T E D.com. And my website is gogated.com. And at gogated.com, you can find all of the properties that are available for sale through our Hilton Head Island multiple listing service. And you can search those on your own at any time or what I would actually recommend that you do is to give me a call and let's get acquainted. Let me send you a list of all the properties that could be for you. 
and uh, that would be in a format that will update automatically. And there's no charge or obligation for that service. It's the best way to monitor your personal real estate market, ladies and gentlemen. I'm a buyer's agent with 39 years of local Hilton Head Island and Bluffton real estate experience. And for those of you that are not familiar with buyer's agency, the questions that I'm most often asked are, uh, what's a buyer's agent and how does it work? Well, buyer's agent represents you, the buyer. And uh, it doesn't cost you anything more to have a buyer's agent. My commission is only paid at closing if you buy and if you close. And it's good for, the concept is good for both buying resale homes as well as new homes like this one from K. Havnanian here at the paddocks. These developers expect you to have an agent on your side and the commission is already built into the price of every new and resale home. So it doesn't cost you anything more to have a buyer's agent, ladies and gentlemen. I certainly recommend that you consider that and keep me top of mind when it comes time for you to choose an agent. You know there's a lot of information out there about properties and communities on the internet. Not so much about agents. So I'd be delighted to hear from you and discuss your real estate needs for a second home or a primary home, be it retirement, vacation rental, whatever it is. And I certainly would like to meet you and work with you as your buyer's agent here on Hilton Head Island or in Bluffton, South Carolina. Just a quick word, the equestrian center here next door is uh, not part of this community, even though the riding trails do go through the community of the paddocks. It's just called the paddocks, I think, because it's adjacent to the Sandy Creek equestrian facility. So if you are uh, an equestrian, if you like horses, couldn't be any more convenient than that, I don't think. But it is actually not uh, owned by the owners here at the paddocks. However, the swimming pool is, and that little clubhouse there to the right is, and it's available for your use. The house that we've been looking at today here, number 16 Hackney Pony Lane. What a beautiful house, ladies and gentlemen. Brand new on Hilton Head Island. There's nothing like a new house. Everything is new and fresh. What a beautiful house. Well, give me a call, please. And let's get acquainted. Find the right home and community for you here in 2015 or whenever you're ready. Uh, <laughs> the record for start to finish in initiating uh, communication with a buyer to their purchase has been for me personally 17 years. Well, don't be like that guy. No, we want to do it in the same year, and this is a good time to buy. We can go into all those details about the market and, of course, about what you're looking for when you call or email. Thank you very much for watching this video. I look forward to meeting you. Thank you again.